Update Control functionality, as part of Design Exploration extension, offers valuable capabilities to better predict and apply design changes. These come especially handy when working with advanced top-down design features like copy geometry or layout feature. In complex or sensitive designs, a small change might lead to many consequent effects. Update control allows getting notifications of changed references and also preview and investigate them before making an update. This model, for example, is using a skeleton that drives some parts geometries via external copy geometry features. To avoid unpredicted changes, I will set certain external copy geometry feature status to manual update with notification. Automatic and manual replace legacy dependent and independent, standing for the behavior of update operation when parent reference objects change. The notification option helps identifying those that get out of date, both on model tree and also easily found from the notification center. No dependency will permanently break external dependencies. That can be done now directly from right mouse button rather than just from global reference viewer. Let's make some changes to the skeleton. This feature is now showing an out of date notification. I can either keep it that way, I can update it, or I can investigate this change to understand its potential impact. Show differences allows previewing changed references in graphics and filter the changed and outdated objects. If I'm happy with this change, I can update and allow propagating those changes to the child referencing objects. That saves earlier need to temporarily set the copy geometry feature to dependent and then set it back to independent for next potential change. If you are not sure and would like to try out this update or other changes without risking working progress, you can instantly fire up design exploration session right here. Notice that two checkpoints are created. Pre-modified contains the original models that were retrieved in the beginning of the session. That would enable you to have batch undo of all iterations, including last one. Entry checkpoint contains the iterated models at the time of initiating design exploration. If I close design exploration and don't accept any checkpoint, I will return to the same state at the point where I initiated it. Reference control has been improved and simplified. If you edit parts in assembly contexts and would like to use assembly references without creating external dependencies, you can set those to be automatically broken immediately after creation, eliminating extra manual efforts as well as unwanted design errors. Update control allows you to better monitor and control design changes and their impact to referencing models making complex and concurrent design projects easier and streamlined. To learn more, please visit PTC Creo Help Center and product page.